All right, so we had installed Open5.js in the previous video and now we are going to install UV Ransom. I've given the installation procedure here. Just install these libraries, including it. I will update it. So, I need to just add this. So, these are the required libraries for installing and building UV Ransom. So the installation is straightforward. All right, so this is done. All right, so the next thing is we need to install CMake. And keep in mind, this is using Snap, which is a different package manager altogether. All right, CMake is done. Now we can clone the Git repository and I will do it in, we create a new uh, directory called UVDansen. And inside this directory, I will just clone this git repository, which is from the ransom. And inside this, I will just do make. So this will take some time to compile the complete source code. So I will just pause the video here. Right, I think it's successfully built and we can just uh, do a random test so keep in mind I haven't configured anything I'll we'll just do dot dot slash build and our denote you know, B I can see from 5gs denote you know, B.yaml and you can see it is working we have some SCTB connection going on so this is it. We have installed UV Ransom on our virtual machine, on the same virtual machine where I've configured Open5.js and in the next video I will show you how you can uh, test it and make the first RRC connection using UV Ransom. I hope you enjoyed this video. In case you did, please give it a thumbs up and I will see you in the next video.